Very good morning to all of you. Yes, as you all know that uh, we have finished our syllabus, all the examples, everything we have finished. And now it's time to start with the revision of the syllabus for the final exam. Now, one thing you have to keep in mind that uh, before starting the revision, one instruction I would like to give you that uh, better to send your notebook uh, well in time without uh, giving any instruction because uh, now you know that syllabus is over so very easily. You can uh, do your work on your notebook, your notebook, and you can send it to me, right? Chale, anyhow, so we'll start with the revision of surface area volume. One thing we will do that uh, we will uh, take uh, take up one exercise, one by one exercise from our uh, NCRT book, and uh, then we will do question based on uh, that exercise, extra question, some extra question based on that exercise. So first of all, I would like to start with exercise 13.1, revision of exercise 13.1. And then we will do some extra questions based on this. 13.1 uh, is based on cube and cuboid. And uh, we did certain formulas, some formulas based on cube and uh, cube and cuboid. Right. Whenever after the lecture, will uh, you will be free? You please call me whenever you will finish your classes. Whenever just give me reaction so that I come to know that you listen to me. Okay. Actually, so we start with the revision of thirteen point one. So in thirteen point one, we learned about cube and cuboid. So first of all, let us recall the formulas. एक एक करके मैं दो दो figures करके हम discuss करेंगे. So better to write the formulas, learn them carefully because this is the part of your final exam. So curved surface. I will not write it. I will show you straightly. If we are talking about the curved surface area, it means uh, all the four faces, area of the four walls, two into L plus B multiplied by L. It means upper and uh, bottom face they are excluding. L B it is excluding, excluded. Bottom and upper face जो है हमारा exclude होता है इसमें. तो इसकी बात करें तो एक आउट सरफेस एरिया हमारे पास टू इंटू एल प्लस बी मल्टीप्लाई एच एंड इफ यू आर टॉकिंग अबाउट द टोटल सरफेस एरिया ऑल द सिक्स फेसेस टू इंटू एल बी प्लस बी एच प्लस एच एल टू इंटू एल बी प्लस बी एच प्लस एच एल दिस इज आर टोटल सरफेस एरिया तो अगर हम वॉल्यूम की बात करें कि वॉल्यूम के वॉल्यूम इज एल इंटू बी इंटू एच दिस इज द वॉल्यूम ऑफ क्यूबॉइड राइट तो टू मोर फॉर्मूलास लेंथ ऑफ डायगनल की बात करें अगर हम डायगनल की लेंथ होती है कि पॉइंट की हमारे पास स्क्वेयर रूट ऑफ एल स्क्वेयर प्लस बी स्क्वेयर प्लस एच स्क्वेयर राइट एंड अगर हम लेंथ ऑफ ऑल दी एजेस की बात करें लेंथ ऑफ ऑल द एजेस इफ यू टॉक अबाउट लेंथ ऑफ ऑल द एजेस दिस इज फोर इंटू एल प्लस बी प्लस एच This is the length of all the edges of cuboid. ये cuboid के सारे edges की length का हमारे पास ये formula है, right? अब चलते हैं cube की तरफ. Cube के भी हमने यही formula किए थे. Let us recall them also. So if we are talking about the curved surface area of cuboid, then you can uh, sorry cube. Now I am discussing cube. So if we are talking about curved surface area of cube, that means four four faces जो आसपास के हैं. So this is four a square total surface area six a square volume edge cube and diagonal ki jo iski hamare paas length hoti hai that is root b a and length of all edges that is equal to twelve. So these are the six formulas on which our first exercise thirteen point one is based. Let us start with the revision of thirteen point one and then extra question based on exercise thirteen point. First question is plastic box. This 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 meter deep is to be made. Opened at the top, ignoring the thickness of the plastic sheet, determine the area of the uh, sheet need for making the box. But when I told you about the void, I told you it very firmly that uh, as far as the top and the bottom faces are concerned, you have to keep in mind that in top and bottom face you include L and B. That means length into breadth जो होता है. वो आपके पास टॉप एंड बॉटम फेस की डायमेंशन है राइट सो इफ वी आर टॉकिंग अबाउट एरिया ऑफ द शीट यूज फॉर एरिया ऑफ शीट 
used to make the keyboard. This is equal to area of the sheet used to make the keyboard. This is equal to uh, keyboardal box. Hum box, box is open at the top. That means all the four faces will be there. 2 into L plus B multiplied by H. All the four faces plus the bottom face. And I told you in bottom face you include, include L into B. So this will be L into B. Sasa calculations karo, Sasa solve karo. It will give you practice side by side. Right? So length, breadth and height are given to you. So you will replace. I am not going to do the calculations this time. So you will do it yourself. So you will replace the value of length, breadth and height in this formula. And you will get the area of the sheet that is used for making the box. Now uh, the dimensions, they are given in terms of meters. And the last dimension height is in terms of centimeter. So it depends upon the course. अगर आपका कोस्ट मीटर में है तो सारी डिमेंशन को मीटर में चेंज कर दो अगर आपका कोस्ट सेंटीमीटर में है सारी डिमेंशन को सेंटीमीटर में चेंज कर दो नाउ योर कोस्ट इज इन टर्म्स ऑफ मीटर्स फाइंड द कोस्ट मेरिंग 1 मीटर स्क्वायर ऑफ द कोस्ट इज ₹20 यू विल डू ऑल दिस इन टर्म्स ऑफ यू कैन से मीटर मीटर में इसको कन्वर्ट करोगे आपके पास इसका आंसर आ जाएगा 4.54 मीटर नाउ कोस्ट एट द रेट कोस्ट एट द रेट 20 5.45 मल्टीप्लाई बाय 20 एंड दिस विल गिव यू द आंसर इन टर्म्स ऑफ रुपीस ठीक है तो ये हमारे पास रुपीस में कोस्ट आ राइट अब चलते हैं हम नेक्स्ट क्वेश्चन की तरफ क्वेश्चन नंबर सेकंड दैट आई एम लीविंग यू कैन डू लेंथ ब्रेड एंड हाइट आर गिवन यू हैव टू फाइंड द कोस्ट ऑफ वाइट वॉशिंग द फोर वॉल्स वाइट वॉशिंग द फोर वॉल्स यू नीड द फॉर्मूला फॉर द फोर वॉल्स एंड देन मल्टीप्लाई द कोस्ट लेट अस डू क्वेश्चन नंबर थर्ड फ्लोर ऑफ ए रेक्टेंगुलर हॉल हैज ए पैरामीटर टू 50 मीटर Rectangular hall, that means base is rectangle and that's, that is making it to be a cuboid. It's a cuboid one. So, we know its length, breadth, height. That L, B, H, B, the length, breadth, height of the cuboid. Length, breadth, and height of the cuboid. Right? So you are given perimeter of the floor. Perimeter is given to be 250 meters. Perimeter is given to be 250 meters. So, जो हमारा perimeter का formula है, that is 2 into L plus E multiplied by X is 250. ठीक है? तो यहाँ पे आप आपके पास perimeter of the sorry perimeter में हमारे पास 2 into L plus E होता है, rectangle के perimeter में. So, this is given to us 2 into L plus E is equal to 250. इसको आप equation number बना. Now, जो next आपके पास line है, that is given that uh, uh, painting of the four walls at the rate of 10 per meter square is rupees 15,000. Painting of the four walls at the rate of 10 uh, per meter square is 15,000. Here yeah, we cost of painting the outer four walls. Ka. So, we can say cost of painting, total cost of painting. Four walls. Total cost of painting four walls. This is equal to fifteen thousand. This is equal to fifteen thousand. And according to question, if the cost of painting the four walls at the rate of ten per meter square, if you want to find the cost of painting of four walls, what you need to do? Area of four walls. 
area of four holes multiply holes per meter square. Area of four walls multiply post per meter square. A four walls ka area kitana hai aapke paas? Area of the four walls to hai. Uh, aapko ne nikalna, aapko nikalna hai height of the wall. Thik hai? Ab area of four walls ka formula lagao. 2 into L plus P multiply by H. Cost per meter square is 10. This is equal to 15. into L plus P multiply by L into 10 equal to 15. तो यहाँ पे आपने जो 2 into L plus P आपका equation number 1 में दिया हुआ था perimeter of the hall उसको put कर देना and that is given to be 250. H into 2500. This is 15,000. So, H is equal to 15,000 over 2500. So, height of the rectangular wall, it comes out to be 6 meters. Question number 4. इन सब पे बेस्ड आपको जो है वो एक्स्ट्रा क्वेश्चंस पेपर में आ सकते हैं सो बी रेडी फॉर ईच एंड एवरी चैलेंज टू मैक्सिमम प्रैक्टिस एट होम एनी वन बुक यू कैन टेक एनी वन सैंपल पेपर यू कैन टेक राइट एंड स्टार्ट प्रैक्टिसिंग क्वेश्चन क्योंकि किसी भी एक्स्ट्रा बुक की हम बात करें तो एक जैसे क्वेश्चंस ही होते हैं कांसेप्ट एक जैसे ही होता है तो यू कैन स्टार्ट प्रैक्टिस फॉर एक्स्ट्रा क्वेश्चन पेंट इन ए सर्टेन कंटेनर इज सफिशिएंट टू पेंट एन एरिया इक्वल टू 9.375 मीटर स्क्वायर सो जो एक कंटेनर है उससे 9.375 मीटर स्क्वायर का uh, जो एरिया है वो पेंट हो सकता है राइट ही सेस हाउ मेनी ब्रिक्स ऑफ डायमेंशन दिस इज दिस कैन बी पेंटेड आउट ऑफ दिस कंटेनर हमें ब्रिक्स की डायमेंशन दी हुई है ब्रिक की डायमेंशन दी हुई है 22.5 लेंथ and uh, you are given the breadth to be 10 centimeter and height to be 7.5 length 22.5 centimeter breadth 10 centimeter and height is 7.5 centimeter So what he says, he says, how many bricks are needed, uh, can be painted of this dimension? So first of all, we'll see that how much area, uh, one brick, uh, kare, so how much area is there to be painted for one brick? So area to be painted for one brick. Area to be painted for one brick. This total surface area or jayega. This form may paint, paint karna to LB plus BH plus H. Aap is sabne values put kar do. This is in terms of centimeter square and you have to get it in the meter square. So, aapka answer aayega 937.5 centimeter square. After putting L, B, H and uh, vagera vagera. तो आपका जो क्वेश्चन है दैट इज इन टर्म्स ऑफ आपका जो कंटेनर है दैट इज इट्स क्वांटिटी इट्स कैपेसिटी इज गिविंग इन टर्म्स ऑफ मीटर स्क्वायर सो अकॉर्डिंगली यू विल गो सो विल राइट लेट n ब्रिक्स बी पेंटेड विद यू कैन से गिवन क्वांटिटी ऑफ पेंट इन द कंटेनर लेट n ब्रिक्स बी पेंटेड सो दिस विल बी 9 3 7.5 ठीक है मान लो हमने n ब्रिक्स पेंट करनी है तो n ब्रिक्स का एरिया टू बी पेंटेड ये हो जाएगा ठीक है एरिया टू बी पेंटेड विद n ब्रिक्स विल बी दिस हमने कहा कि इस कंटेनर के पेंट से हम n ब्रिक्स को पेंट कर सकते हैं तो इसका मतलब n ब्रिक्स का एरिया टू बी पेंटेड दिस इज इक्वल टू टोटल एरिया टू बी पेंटेड दिस इज इन सेंटीमीटर एंड दैट इज 
So you need to find n from here. So n is equal to 9.375 meters square over 9375 centimeters. Yes, centimeter square aapka meter square may convert ho jayega. 9.375 meters square and 9375 is to divide kar do 100 into 100 se meters square. When you will solve it, you will get 100 bricks. Isko solve karne ke baad aapka answer jo aayega, that will be 100 bricks. Come starting with question number six of the same exercise. Sixth question. So next question, it is, I am uh, discussing question number six, a small indoor greenhouse is made up entirely of glass planes, hold together with paint, any meter long, itne meter uh, wide and itne meter high. So dimensions of a new year, greenhouse, uh, equilibrium key, this is 30 meter. Breadth is 25 centimeter. Centimeters it on in the And uh, and same height is given 25. What he says, he says, what is the area of the glass which is needed to make the uh, greenhouse? Uh, you can say indoor, indoor greenhouse. So the area glass needed. is equal to total surface glass needed is equal to total surface area so this is 2 into lb plus bh plus h Values put kar do. So, 30 into 25, 25 into 25, 25 into 25. This much glass is needed, hai na? Ye glass humme chahi. So, aap put karo iski values. Uh, aapke paas uh, uh, solve karke dekho kitna aar hai. That will be the quantity of the glass which is needed to make this indoor greenhouse. Now, the next part, which is uh, something uh, that you are not uh, doing frequently, that is, what is the length of the tape which is needed to, for all the edges to be taped? So, length of uh, tape length of the tape needed is equal to length of velvet and uh, that is 4 into L plus B plus H. This formula is not because it is not used frequently. Zada tariye use nahi hota. So that's why the students go to for it. 30 plus 25 plus 4 into 18. 320. You can say 320 centimeters, right? Now, next question, Shanti sweet stall, very important. So many times there in the board paper. Let us start with. So, you know the gist of the question. There are two dimensions of boxes that the sweet stall is required to make. One is of the bigger dimension. Bigger boxes. 
अनदर आर द तो अगर हम बिगर बॉक्स की बात करें इसकी हमारे पास लेंथ है 25 सेंटीमीटर ब्रेथ इज 20 सेंटीमीटर एंड हाइट इज 5 सेंटीमीटर स्मॉलर बॉक्स की बात करें लेंथ ब्रेथ एंड हाइट अगर हम स्मॉलर बॉक्स के बारे में देखें तो डायमेंशंस आर गिवन टू बी 15 सेंटीमीटर 12 सेंटीमीटर and pipes. These are the dimensions of smaller box. 15, 12 and 5. He says for all the overlaps 5% of the total surface area is required. Extra. Post of cardboard. This is secondary. First of all we will see that how much cardboard is needed to arrange 250 of 250 boxes of each kind in which 5% uh, you can say uh, overlaps are also needed. Right? So, we do this. First, we uh, one box of each kind. Ka सब कुछ निकाल के उसको 250 से विल मल्टीप्लाई सो फर्स्ट ऑफ ऑल टोटल सरफेस एरिया बिगर बॉक्स का दिस इज 2 lb plus bh plus xs दिस इज 2 25 into 20 20 into 5 h into Solid, this, this will be the total surface area of the one box. That is 1450 cm. On the other hand, total surface area of one smaller box. Two LP. Putting the values, you will get the answer to be 630. Five percent uh, area of the total overlap is needed. So the extra cardboard needed. Five percent of dono ko add karo. Fourteen fifty plus three sixty. Right? Five percent of dono ko add karke uska ham five percent jo hai wo nikal lenge. That will give you the total. Extra. This is one zero. So total cardboard for one box. Smaller, bigger, dono tarah ka ek box. Uske liye hum total cardboard nikal rahe hain. Fourteen fifty plus six thirty plus one zero. Fourteen fifty plus six thirty. Plus one zero four. This will give you two one eight four cent. This is the cardboard which is needed for one kind of box. And we are having how many boxes? Two fifty boxes. So cardboard needed for two fifty boxes. Two fifty into one eight. Uh, two fifty into two one eight four. So that will be the cardboard which is uh, required for uh, two fifty boxes, right? Abhi isko aise rehne do. Aage kati ho jayegi. And uh, how the post is given? पोस्ट जो है हमारे पास वो आ, 100 सेंटीमीटर स्क्वायर के लिए 1000 सेंटीमीटर स्क्वायर के लिए रुपीस फोर है रुपीस फोर वन सेंटीमीटर स्क्वायर के लिए फोर बाय थाउजेंड और जितना हमारे पास क्वांटिटी है उसके लिए फोर बाय थाउजेंड इनटू टू फिफ्टी इनटू टू वन एट मल्टीप्लाई and uh, you will get the answer and it is 2184 rupees. Rupees 2184 is the answer for this. Right? Important head question. Next question. Parveen. Parveen wanted to make a temporary shelter for her car by making a box like structure with tarpin that covers all the four sides and the top of the car. Assuming that margins are very small, therefore negligible. And uh, how much tarpin would be required to make this? 
the shelter of height 2.5 meter and base dimension as एक तरह से हमें टार्पिन की क्वांटिटी निकालनी है जिससे कि वो अपनी कार का इस तरह का शेल्टर बनाना चाहता है तो नेचुरली जब कार का शेल्टर बनाएगा तो बॉटम थोड़ा बनाएगा नीचे पहले थोड़ा बिछाएगा उसके ऊपर कार रखेगा ऐसा तो नहीं है बॉटम विल नॉट बी देयर सो द कार्डबोर्ड विच इज नीडेड कार्डबोर्ड नीडेड फोर शेल्टर This is equal to area of the four holes, two into L plus B multiplied H plus the top, top is L. ठीक है? तो यहाँ पे L B H की आप जो है values put कर दो. तो put करके आपके पास two L आपके पास दिया हुआ है. L is four, breadth is three, and the height it is uh, given to be two point five. एग्जाम्पल्स मैं आगे डिस्कस कर चुकी हूँ फर्स्ट टर्म में तो आप एग्जाम्पल्स अपने आप करोगे अब एंड नाउ वी विल डू समा क्वेश्चन रिलेटेड टू क्यूब एंड क्यूबॉइड Let us start. Dimensions of a cuboid are. Start the calculations. Dimensions of a cuboid are in the ratio one ratio two ratio. These are the dimensions of the cuboid whose uh, ratio is given to be one ratio two ratio three, right? And uh, the total surface area is given to be eighty. Total surface area is given to be eighty-eight. Find the dimensions of the cuboid. हमें find करनी है cuboid की dimensions, right? तो ये आपके पास है dimensions. जब भी हमें ratio में दिया होता है, हम उसको find करते हैं, लिखते हैं ऐसे. Let the dimensions be two x, uh, sorry x, two x and three x. Total surface area is eighty-eight. That is two into L B plus B H plus H L. This is eighty-eight. Putting the values, two into x into two x plus two x into three x, three x into x equal to eighty-eight. Right? Solving it further, we will be having two into two x square plus six x square plus three x square is equal to eighty. 11x square 88, 22x square 88, x square is 4, x is 2. So after doing the calculations, we are getting x is equal to 2. Therefore, dimensions are dimensions are like the x 2, 2x 4, 3x. These are the dimensions of the cube. So we'll continue tomorrow. Please send your copies for final checking right don't take it casually this contains marks right so hope you all are well at your place goodbye